true that artificial additives, colors, and chemicals in kids' candy and sweets have negative health effects, both mentally and physically, and are interfering with the kids' ability to perform well academically and suppressing their immune system. And if that's the case, what would be a better alternative to give to the kids to satisfy their sweet cravings. Hi, my name is Dr. El Mohandes. I'm an integrated medicine practitioner, doctor of physical therapy, certified nutritionist and anti-aging specialist, and certified clinical educator based in DC. Actually, these artificial additives in kids' candy and sweets are linked to interruptions in transmitter functions leading to changes in behavior and mood, which leads to hyperactivity and inability to focus and concentrate, which can negatively impact the kids' ability to learn and perform well academically. They are also linked to triggering immune response that manifests itself in terms of allergies and sensitivities, as these additives uh, suppress their immune system as they interrupt the integrity and the health of their microbiome. They also interrupt metabolic processes in the body leading to hormonal imbalances, which further worsen the condition in terms of bad hyperactivity and lack of focus and concentration. So just keep this in mind. Once in a while, it's not a big deal, but a better alternative would be giving the kids something that is nutritious and um, sweet at the same time, such as sliced fruits, uh, yogurts with uh, natural sweeten sweeteners, such as uh, raw honey or maple syrup. Also, a trial mix that has nuts and dried fruits is a good alternative, or even homemade popsicles uh, using natural fruit juice is also a, a better alternative. So just keep this in mind and support your kids to do well, both academically and immunologically. Um, and that is uh, really important for the kids to help build both cognitive reserve that will help them future, you know, with their future plans, as well as health reserve.